karibu ndani ya mishemishe. Now this time Morara Kipaswa amejitokeza tena hii ni baada ya kusema kwamba he's taking a break from uh, whatever he was doing the activism thing na amejitokeza na ujumbe kwa Rigathi Gashagwa hii ni baada ya impeachment ya Rigathi Gashagwa kuendelea Morara Kibaso amejitokeza na kupost katika social media platforms zake kwamba I never kick a man when he is down hello at Rigathi You have a missed call from me. I believe you have a lot of information that can help me in my vampire diaries. Would you like to share this info? Huyo ni Morara Kebaso, amepost kwenye social media zake na anatumai kwamba Rigi J atapata kuona, pengine wapate kuzungumza. Kwenye comment section alielezwa kwamba I thought we were deep cleaning the system. Clip yako juzi ulisema this revolution doesn't need people already with blemishes. Keep the slate squeaky clean kiongozi. Emoni yako ni epic kuhusiana na hili kwamba Morara aliweka wazi kwamba he's taking a break na hivi sasa amerudi. This is just a day after saying kwamba anachukua break from Uh, his activism na just a day after amejitokeza and remember uh, pale bombers morara aliumizwa alirushiwa viti na kumia i thought that is what also led him to take a break na alisema kwamba hawezi kwa kifanyia watu kazi na wakati anahitaji watu nobody is there to show up for him umaoni yako ni yapi kindly put down on the comment section below fellow kenyans brothers and sisters We have all come to the profound realization that our country is on sale. Shockingly, the buyer is also the seller. Kenya yetu inauzwa na cha kushangaza muuzaji ndiye mununuzi. In the year 2013, a group of powerful individuals sat in a room and made a plan to be the wealthiest men in the world to the disenfranchisement of many Kenyans. They hatched a grand scheme that would earn them an empire only similar to the Russian oligarchs. It was simple. Steal as much as you can. Make Kenya poor.